Hello everybody, Sift3 again with another new Sundown run. So uh, yeah, let's get to it. I mean, we were where we were, so we got our upgrades going. And uh, yeah, let's run. Let's do a run. Fear Factory, I guess. Yeah, why not Fear Factory? By the way, do I have bot piercing? Yeah, I have bot piercing bullets. So we're gonna go piercing bullets, damage, uh, XP percentage, and then I would say heal, steal life from each enemy when killed. This was 0 0.05 yesterday, and now it's 0 0.01. Okay. And um, yeah, I think that's it pretty much. Like XP, attack, 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 and HP regen, I guess, because now life steals trash. Otherwise, I would go for this. Anyway, let's get to it. Start your factory. Continue. Let's go with a new ship, as it is pretty broken. Can I just reuse the old one? Nope. So we're gonna go XP. By the way, I think... It, it it shouldn't say level plus one here i mean level plus one is okay but we would i would like to have some knowledge of what these do you know when i'm trying to choose them uh the icons might seem easily discernible but maybe they're not for everybody wait did i pick xp pickup range no no let's go xp regen hp regen let's go look at this we've got the machine gun build going and now that we've got piercing yeah piercing should carry us through this Brawler. Enemies deal less damage, but lower my mobility by 5%. This is really powerful, by the way, in my opinion. Scythe build. Uh, we learned yesterday that the scythe ne needs multi-attack for it to actually work. Should I try the scythe build today again with multi-attack? Yeah, I'm gonna do that, but first we're gonna go for a bit of attack. You know, let's first get a very powerful run going, and then we're gonna try to, you know, get a, a fun run alongside it. Split shot. Yeah, we're gonna go split shot. Let's be honest. We need some powerful things here to keep us alive and carry us later. As I said, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go with the scythe. It needs multi-shot attack anyway. Overclock for attack speed. Let's continue going for more attack speed. In general, this thing, because it attacks a lot faster, it is obviously better uh, in an attack-focused build. Another thing, XP pickup range. Nah, doubles it says, and from 20 it goes to... Plus 10. Like, wh where do you see the doubling there? <laughs> we found the multi-shot, so we're gonna go multi-shot for sure. I'm gonna go three multi-shots, and then I'm gonna start going with the scythes. Like, let's first get everything uh, up and running, the powerful version, and then we can care about the, the fun version, as I said. XP gain. We always, always, always pick up XP gain, especially this early. In my opinion, XP gain is the best thing in this game. Let's see what we go with. Uh, you know what? I should also start re-rolling. Maybe to find the things I need. Uh, let's go with multi-shot again. We are only losing damage anyway. Look how many explosions we got going. Nice. Now we're doing one damage per hit. I increased the bitrate a bit. I hope it's not going to be as bad as it was yesterday. Let's go multi-shot. Yep, now we have three of them. And we're pretty much ready with the multi-shot part. Now I'm going to start picking up the scythes. Obviously, alongside anything else that we care a bit more about. I should start rerolling more often, man. I'm, I'm forgetting to use all my rerolls. XP gain. I should always, always, always use my both of my rerolls as I get them back. Because I want to chase down XP, you know. As XP is extremely important to get early. So, we're gonna reroll this. And we're gonna reroll this again. And we are gonna get teleported, in my opinion. Like yesterday. Because teleport is completely busted. And uh, maybe after this first run, we're gonna get a second run going that is not gonna be the same thing but for now let's try to go for the big powerful moves uh most likely gonna go attack speed actually damage so let's reroll this let's reroll this again okay we go damage uh, i'm trying to roll xp in case it's not <laughs> extremely obvious xp gain percentage teleport let's uh let's reroll this xp range nah let's pick up the teleport Honestly, though, maybe maybe this specific should have been the XP pickup range. Because it's all also important to have a bit of more pickup range. As uh, even though there is a global pickup range. Let's go with split shot here. Although there is a global pickup happening after the, the XP, you know, expires. You still only get half the XP. Okay, we got our all attack speed. We got our all projectiles. Now we only need to get my scythes. Multi shot is here. Ah, let's reroll this again. Maybe it's maybe we go. Let's, let's. I can't even trust myself with what I'm saying. <laughs> Continue with split shots. 
I'm I'm gonna go the attack. And now that I have this this ship that has so much attack speed, we're gonna go with win win first, fun later. And we're gonna get our fun time anyway. I don't think like it's gonna go that bad. Speed gain. No questions asked. It's percentage based. The warp, and it's definitely gonna pay up at the end. Pay back. Speed gain. I know I'm not gaining damage out of this, but once again, it's gonna definitely, definitely pay itself back. So whenever I see these little sh sh like these little arrows up here, th it means that there is always seems like it's always um, with damage. It's always some kind of honor unit in the back. As we're destroying most of the things we're shooting at. Okay, so we have a spawner at the top left. That's what I understand with these little. Yep. Here it is. Let's go attack speed. We're gonna reroll though. We're gonna reroll first fight XP game. Nice. Actually, I should start the scythe upgrades. You know, if it's, this is gonna be a scythe run, I should start getting some scythe upgrades going. Uh, reroll this. Now let's take the scythe. I mean, I said we're gonna go scythe anyway. And now we also got our multi-attacks fully leveled up, so theoretically we should get the legendary. Yeah, Scythe if it exists. Oh, attack speed here. This not. This also not. Uh, let's go with damage. No, let's go with attack speed. Shooting more projectiles. This is toast. So pickup range doesn't really matter if you can literally run into all the XP that is on the ground. I'm gonna roll this. I'm gonna reroll. I like this as an idea, by the way. 25% less damage taken is very much. Let's go with 25% less damage taken. Like 5% at movement speed does not matter if this 25% less damage taken is gonna protect us from those huge hunks. And I wanna see if it's gonna reduce it even more than 25. I'm pretty sure it's gonna have diminishing returns instead of having, you know, positive returns. Imagine, <laughs> take that for four times and you are damage immune. Uh, well, I guess we're forced to pick up. We could go for the region. But I don't think we're gonna lose from region. Actually, let's go with pickup range. Like, being able to pick up the XP for a bit further away is gonna help us later. When I'm gonna be backpedaling all the time against all the opponents all the time. Synergy between shuriken and explosives. Uh, that's most likely not gonna happen now. A scythe is most likely the upgrade we're gonna go with. Okay, let's go with the scythe then. I want to have enough, um, what is it called, enough survivability to maybe not get one shot from these guys because we know what's going to happen. We know exactly how we're going to lose this run. <laughs> I'm going to blink into a huge person, this huge ship, and it's going to one shot us. Roll this. How do we roll this? Okay, 19%. But also less movement speed cut off us. I like this. Taking 60% damage of what I should have. Yeah, we're pretty powerful right now that it's a good chance to go for it. So right now we're at about 40% less damage taken. Or I only take 60% of the damage that I should have, depending on how you want to see this. Could go for more damage too. Throw this away. Throw this away. Okay, look at this. Right now, no, I'm only taking 56% of the damage taken. And if I take this, I'm going to be taking 42% of the damage taken. We're going to obviously go for the scythe, as that is the build. But uh, this, uh, this you take less damage and move a, a smidge slower, which doesn't even matter that you move slower because obviously blink. I hope nothing gets nerfed in this game, man. I hope everything stays broken because at the end of the day, it's an it's a run, it's a game that you're supposed to be broken. And if anything else, the, the game has infinite mode anyway. So even even if I'm quote unquote immune, at some point too many opponents will arrive. We will always reroll to see what we can get. Mm, yeah, we'll continue with the scythe. Because we want to get the legendary scythes, see what they do, how they look, how they fare. No, no, no. I'm still afraid of those huge juggernauts. I'm not sure if they are a forced you die instantly, or if they just do like 100 damage and uh, that's why I die. If it's like they do 50 damage or 60 damage, then at some point I will be not able to die from them because of Brawler. But let's reel this. I would say attack speed. Especially because it's from one point, from, yeah, from 0 0.12 we went to 0 0.10, which is like almost 
faster. I mean, it's 50% faster. Whoa, 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 whoa. The piercing, by the way, against those opponents makes it so that I'm not pushing them. I'm just blasting them and then explosions appear from behind them that also hit them. So that's not really that good for us. Because, uh, because I cannot push them away. <laughs> I don't think there is anything else to explain here. Scythe, nice. Roll this, roll this. I'll go with Scythe level 4. Synergy available, Dual Reaper. Okay. Now I know. Now I know. So now I hope we're gonna find the Dual Reaper. That's what I understand, right? Does that mean that what I mean it is? Or... By the way, I, I still believe that... Mm, I don't know. I was about to say that I believe the, the, sh the legendary upgrades of weapons should not be bound on having specific items in your build. Uh, but do, do I believe that really? I mean, I do believe that. But on the other hand, then what would make them legendary is the question. Ooh, I'm not gonna take that. I'm gonna take one of these two. Let's go with 14% less damage taken. I know it says 25, but you know, 14 is the, the, the end product there. What is this? Why, why did time freeze this week? What happened? This is the first thing that happened. Someone two deadly high damaging scythe synergy card. How, wh what, what exactly happened there? Oh, this is insane, and I love it. Okay, you know, if it's gonna be so huge, then yes, I'm okay with it actually needing specific things to happen. I was expecting it to be like a small little joke. Nice, 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 nice. I really enjoy this thing. Wait, but what did tri what what triggered? I, I I never realized what triggered the like I, I didn't get a level or anything. It just happened. Uh, roll this, roll this. I uh, would say attack speed. Another 15%, which is gonna be actually... I'm gonna be shooting like... I don't know, every 5 times one more time. Because from 0.1 attack speed, which I would assume... Like 0.1 attack speed, I guess means I'm attacking every 0.1 seconds. So I'm attacking like 10 times per second. Now with 0.8 attack speed, I'm attacking... Um, I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know how to exactly calculate it right now. I guess 1 divided by 0 0.8. 0 0.08 actually. Let's damage. We're gonna reroll obviously first. I will go with damage. So are these scythes further upgradable or, or... Or is that it? They just scythe around. Arena full of explosives and bombs. Okay, we unlock the new arena. Good to know. How much damage do these do by the way? 6 to 7. They do a lot. Do they one-shot this? No, they don't one-shot that. Okay, they do a lot, but they're not going fast enough around. They are one-shotting everything that's small. But they're pretty useless against every anything else. I should have re-rolled this, by the way. Uh, I guess HP reach... Uh, let's go cooldown on the blink. In case panic modes, uh, panic mode happens. Although I should have actually not gotten that at all. I should have gotten max life. Because I still don't know if I'm gonna get one shot or not. So by going a bunch of max life and also a bunch of less damage taken, I will have an uh, experiment going, right? Also, madness is already happening a bit. Okay, let's reroll this. Let's reroll this. Here we go with damage. Do I have full XP? Can I even see the cards I have on me? Is that a thing in this game? Can I see? Ooh, ooh, wait a minute, you pause and everything moves away. <laughs> Synergies? Ah, this is also good. Oh, this is actually insanely good. Wow, I'm happy that they have this. Blast shurikens. Expl I'm not gonna go explosives this run. Uh, maybe next run, maybe next run we're gonna go shurikens and explosives. So, and you have to have three out of three. Oh, th this is very good. Like, I enjoy this a lot. Good job, uh, game creator, for this as an idea. Mm, yeah, I mean, also having the whole the stats here, insane, insane. I love it. Why did I pause? I guess I wanted to see how many XP cards I have. Wait, was it visible somewhere? No, it's not visible somewhere. So you cannot see your cards. Good to know, good to know. I'm gonna assume that they're gonna add deck. Ooh, I was not able to get the currency there. Brawler, I would say. Let's reroll explosives though. Let's reroll the mine. I would say Brawler. Take 11% less damage, so only take 3D. 31% of the damage taken is the real damage we take. So at this point, if I die from this huge thing, well, I guess it's a one-shot. I mean, I'm taking 33%, like 60, 69% less damage. 
from it, and it still kills me. Yeah, that that, that just goes to show that it's damage immune. Uh, it's an insta kill, not damage immune. <laughs> the opposite of like, not even remotely close. The damage immune has nothing to do with it, and uh, I can go with even less damage taken. We're gonna go with even less damage taken. I don't care. We take nothing. So theoretically, all these should not really be any concern to me. Yeah, look. Ah, I mean, I do take damage. And it seems like I unlocked something, which I didn't read fast enough. Also would like to gather all this XP up. I do enjoy double the XP that I would have gotten. That I get. Piercing. This is what I unlocked. Increase the amount of enemies pierced. Mm, no. Not really. I don't want that yet. You know what? Let's go shurikens. And if I get level 5 shurikens, might as well go with explosives, you know. If I, if I make it and survive it. I'm not gonna chase it down. I still will try to go for things that are better for the build specifically. But if we get it, then we get it, you know. There is no reason not to take it. I I'm avoiding explosives specifically. The shurikens are not a problem for me. So if... If, if, if I'm forced to get explosives just to try the new legend, the other legendary, then I'm okay with it. But I'm not gonna pick up explosives first. Explosives are gonna come later. Okay, maybe I should also go with piercing. Although, honestly, it seems like piercing works pretty decent already. I could go for safeguard to not get one shot. Let's go for safeguard. Experiment, man. Experimenting time. If I have, if I get my safeguard up to level 5 and have like a bunch of life. And, and I also have Brawler, which makes sure that I take like 80% less right now. Can I die from the huge ship? Can I die in general, actually? Like, if I have a huge amount of health, a huge amount of damage reduction, and also HP regen, like, we're slowly building up to a tank. Increased stun length on, on enemies. Okay. Oh man, I enjoy the fact that we're getting a million small ones. Try to destroy the big one there. Throw this away. Uh, throw this away. Let's go with regen. Let's let's try to create the tank I was talking about. You know? A bit of regen. If I get like one one HP per second from regen, and also 80% less damage taken, and also 25 more max life. I mean, if I start with 15 life and through the upgrades I go up to 50, I should be like a lot tankier. I think I need one more piercing. Yeah, I definitely need one more piercing level. For sure. I think at this point it's like a given. These blinks are dangerous, by the way. Yeah, I need one more piercing for sure. Let's get it. Uh, let's first reroll, though. Uh, let's get the piercing here. With more piercing, I should be able to hit more things. I mean, that's literally what it is there for. Okay, so the small, the small enemies don't really do anything to us, as the scythes one-shot them. So we only have to deal with the medium opponents and also the huge opponents. Anything else should be carried by this. Receive an additional card redraw. Nice, now we have three rerolls re for fight. Oh, whoa, whoa, we're getting surrounded here. Yo, chill, chill, chill. Chill opponents. Chill opponents. Oh, look what's happening. I'm pretty sure nobody is seeing anything right now because of the frame rate and stuff. Trying to blink away. Whoa, we're dead. Oh, we're still alive. Nice. Reroll this. Reroll this. Should have rerolled this, by the way. Let's go with HP regen. Maybe that's gonna save us. Oh, I have one more reroll. Reroll this. Yeah, we're gonna go with HP regen here, and we're dead. I tried to blink there last second, but it wasn't fast enough. Wow, we we did not actually increase our time, like, almost at all. But doesn't matter. This went actually pretty decent. Let's go to store. Let's, uh, I would say let's go XP gain. In general, getting cards is the most fun part. I know that these things are really good. Let's go with XP gain. Let's go with pickup range. Did I have that previously? I didn't have that. I would say one more lifesteal upgrade and not get the HP regen. So let's get lifesteal. Let's get range. So we're going to upgrade this. By the way, these have like different currencies anyway. So I'm not afraid of that. Who cares about the young rage? Who cares about movement speed? And uh, damage against piercing. I would say let's go with more damage. We we'll also go with attack speed instead of piercing in general. Like, get the baseline attack speed and then get piercing in the run. I think that's better. Oh, these only cost 5. Since when? I guess they changed it. Nice, nice, good patch, good patch, good patch. Yeah, let's get attack speed instead of piercing. As 
I do prefer getting one more attack speed as I'm getting attack speed anyway whenever I can and just get one piercing upgrade inside the run. So yeah, let's do another one. Let's do another one. I can do like three, two runs real quick. Bombers. Okay. Triangle. Phase infinity. Okay, so it begins with these. Wait a minute. Ah, you can see the phases here. Ah, here in the infinity you fight ghouls. Oh, you can even see the damage. They do 10? That's a lie. These things don't do 10 damage. I instantly die from these. Maybe they changed it, you know? This game has a bunch of patches really often. Maybe they changed it and made this so that it's not a one-shot. Anything that does that amount of damage? This does a thousand. If you touch it, you instantly die. Anyway. Um, yeah, I mean, it's only two waves. Seems that's gonna be fighters, bombers, buzzsaws, and triangles at the end. So, yeah. 25 each for two seconds. Triangles are gonna destroy us. Triangles are the move fast things. What is this? I don't understand what this is. Let's say I choose this and then do this. No idea. So we go XP gain. Yeah, XP gain. XP pickup. Attack damage. Attack speed. And lifesteal. Survive for 10 minutes. What is this? Is the stage different than the most? Most of the stages? We're gonna go attack speed. Let's reroll first twice though. Seems to me that the stage is a bit different. Where are you guys going? Hello? The opponents are randomly going to random places. Increase stun length by 0.2. Split shot first, I would say. I'm gonna do an explosive run. I'm gonna do an explosive run. I wanna do this shuriken thing. This is gonna add a bit of a... Mm, yeah, I think it's good enough. This it's, it's, it's really enough to get the explosive so we get a bunch of XP here. Let's also get multi-shot so everything explodes around us. Unfitty and fireworks XP gain, obviously. I should also not forget to reroll all the time. I don't know why I'm forgetting it all the time. XP gain. I mean, if it's XP gain, I'm 100% of the time picking it up. Uh, we're gonna get more. No, we're gonna get attack speed here. So I would say reroll this. XP gain. <laughs> okay, go in there for the XP. XP gain. Shift stop picking up XP gain, man. I would say throw this away. I think we're gonna go split shot here. Uh, so yeah, throw this away. Piercing. That's good. Let's go piercing. As it seems like it, it explodes and pierces. Yeah, that seems to be the case. Or am I wrong about this? I might be wrong about this. Shuriken? I mean th that is literally what we would try to go for. But I think we should start with Brawler first to not die. I mean, there are, th these are all so good choices. Now we're gonna go shurikens. We're gonna try to get the, the combo going. I try to fish for XP gain, obviously. <laughs> As always. So is this like a cube or is it only from left and right a cube? XP gain. No, it is actually a cube. So we are inside a cube. I enjoy this. I enjoy the fact that the stage is simple enough, you know, but it's a cube. <laughs> Pickup range. I don't think so. This definitely not. This also not. This is a good choice. Actually, let's go with XP range. Let's make it almost global. I think it might even be global at this point. Uh, at least screen wide. Let's throw this away. Let's get the brawler. I need one brawler for sure. Fishing for XP gain. I got hit. Ingenious. So we got mines that we have to deal with. Which isn't that good. Let's pull the spread away, away. Attack speed. Mm, let's get a blink to have the choice of avoiding. And actually, no, I'm always going with blink. Let, let's get something else this time. Let's get shuriken here for sure. Multi shot, teleport. Yeah, let's get blink. Shuriken. I want to get my legendary shuriken as fast as possible. Maybe we can see it, you know, before an infinite phase starts and we're going to get destroyed here. As uh, this should not be as easy as most of these. Should also chase down these guys. Piercing is here. I already got piercing. Through all of this. Through all of this. Multi shot. I mean, I don't have a multi shot yet. Let's roll this. Let's go with multi shot. Yeah, now I have two shots. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Actually, what? What? Whoa, the mines do a lot of damage. Okay. Um. I did not expect that. I, we're gonna run this again. Like, this was an extremely bad run. Accept your fate, and, and it's like, whoops, you die. 
Whoopsie. Okay, we're not gonna go for explosives right away. Forget it. We're gonna do the normal run in the beginning, and then we're gonna roll into explosives. XP gain. We're gonna first run with XP gain. Then we're gonna go with the... More. We're gonna first create the broken build, and then we're gonna try to get this shuriken thing going, like we did with the scythe, right? First you create the broken build, then you try to get the thing going. Then you... The first power, then fun. My opinion... And also avoid the mines. <laughs> nope. Yes. Gonna be the piercing. Mm, nope. Yes. Very nice. This is free XP, by the way. There are like cruisers going around with XP. Nope. Also no. This is a yes. Let's throw this away. Nice. Should gain a level or two in a bit. Nice. I like this. Nope. Nope. Mm, nope. Yeah, let's go with a bit more multi shot. A bit more splitting. We're cornered a bit. Doesn't matter. We gain XP here. Nope. 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 Uh, I would say let's continue with a million multi shots. It doesn't matter if I have less attack speed. If I'm gonna shoot once and it's gonna be 7,000 bullets. Throw this away, throw this away, throw this away. Yep, damage it is. I just need one multi shot. What, a single multi shot and then always damage, damage, damage. Nope, nope, nope. Attack speed. I would say yes to attack speed, honestly. I prefer to have a bit more of a faster attack going. Obviously, the split shot does reduce my attack speed, but that's the. I, I'm okay with paying that price. Damage, multi shot. Yeah, we found the multi shot. Let's try to see if we find XP gain. Multi shot, nice. Now I'm shooting twice. Okay, now I, I should be pretty powerful already. I can get another two multi shots, of course, like we previously did. Nope. 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 Let's go damage. Damage. So we pretty much destroy everything. Can I attack the thing around? Explosives? I don't want to pick it up this early. Reroll, reroll, reroll. First we're going to build up the shurikens, and then we're going to build up the explosives. It's literally going to be the same thing I did previously. Um, I mean, I, I don't have yet enough... Yeah, seems like I can attack the... the round around. But doesn't seem to be doing anything. Nope, nope. Uh, nope. Yeah, let's get the mines. Let's get the mines. Place down mines that explode on impact. But do they hit me too? No, right? Imagine if they hit us too. Okay, so I'm 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 building up like a small little fort. I'm not sure if the mines are a good item. <laughs> Overclock for attack speed. Uh, we're gonna reroll obviously first a bit. You know we're gonna get attack speed. I mean I'm I'm spamming mines all the time. There is no reason not to. Seems like there is no no cap anyway. Nah, I'm not. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna stick to the mines for a moment. Let's go with Brawler. Let's uh, try to not get one shot, like previously. I don't know how much damage the mines do, but let's try avoid getting one shot like previously, as I said. And we should explode most of the mines randomly, you know, by shooting. Mm, nope. 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 And uh, let's get attack speed. Nice. I would like to find Shuriken slowly. I'm in no rush, obviously. That's why I said slowly. We're still at the two minute mark. Okay. No, no, no. Well, um, I, I, I guess we go with piercing. I mean, I, I can pick this, as I have not leveled up the mines anyway. And then if I find the mines again, I can re-pick the mines. So it's pretty much one more reroll. Yeah, let's do that. Torpedoes, that's pretty mediocre. Let's go with piercing. Now I just need to find the mines again. <laughs> okay, just running around, picking up the XP we left. Because of all the mines. Okay, piercing. Nope. Why did I throw that first away? Stun. Explosives. Low guard. Okay, I would say multi shot. I say multi shot. More attacks, better.
We didn't really roll what we needed, right? Not, nothing of the things I would like to get out here. Where are my shurikens, by the way? Can I please get a few shurikens? I like how the mines are still doing work. Yeah, the mines are still doing work. I would say no to bullet spread. Okay, these are both good. Okay, we're gonna go with damage. Very nice. I still believe the pulse is pretty trash. Yeah, I'm starting to lose my mines on the board. So I would really enjoy it if we could get back the mines power up. Not that, by the way, the mines power up was really good. Look how many mines I, I had time to place down. Nope. Nope. Mm, I mean, blink is better than what I have, so let's take the blink. Uh, I take I took it, by the way, if it wasn't apparent. And we're not going to go scythe again. Yeah, damn. Nope. Time. Yeah, attack speed. Nice. Now I have the blink again. So theoretically, I should be able to blink away from danger now. Okay. Uh, we are in phase infinity. So now we will start seeing pretty much the same opponents from here and out until the rest of the run. But they're also just cruising. So wait, the only opponents that are actually trying to hit us are the mine guys. And everything else is just cruising around the map. Found the shuriken. Yay. Safeguard. Nope. Nope. Okay, we're gonna take the shuriken here. Maybe we're gonna start finding it more often now that I got it, I guess. Is there any chance that we're not gonna be finding the... The what is it called? The mines on the ground because I picked it up and then I deleted it. If there is a mechanic like this, then I'm obviously we should obviously start abusing it by always starting with the items that we don't want and then replace them. Nope. Nope. Speed range. I could. Uh, let's pick XP range once. Just so that we don't lose out on any XP. Synergy between stun and piercing. Wait, what? Synergy. Oh, energy bullets. Replaces normal bullets with energy chaining energy bolts. Oh, I love it. Stun and piercing. Okay, we chase this now. Yeah, let's chase this while also chasing this. One of the two is going to happen. This needs seven more cards. This needs six more cards. So we're very far away of any of these two. I'm not even sure how much harder this is going to become. We have like... We're at the four minute mark. Now we have time. I think about the ten minute mark is where craziness starts happening. These opponents aren't even trying to attack us anyway. Want the shot safeguard away. Torpedoes away. Region away. Piercing. I would say yes to piercing. We're gonna do it, man. We're gonna do the piercing... Uh... Piercing what? Piercing stun bullets. Nothing is gonna be moving anywhere around the map. Everything is gonna be frozen in time. So now opponents are appearing. As our mines have run out. Yeah, I start believing mine power up is really good. There was no reason not to indicate that anyway. Explosives. I only have one shuriken. We're not going to take explosives yet. Our shuriken. And our piercing. Hmm. Mm, let's go with shurikens. Explosive shurikens. I mean, I, I don't want to pick explosives up at all, if possible. Let's, uh, let's go explosive shurikens. Trying to get my... What is over there, by the way? What am I attacking? Is there some kind of secret boss out of out of the map? That I'm not seeing? That's what I, I, I see mines in front of us. I'm starting to get a bit anxious here. Robust mines. Yeah, I can take this for free. Whoop, took it. Inside, no. First thing is a yes, but this is a, a more of a yes. We're gonna reroll this thing. Let's take... Uh, we're gonna reroll this too. Let's take this. Okay, now I start placing mines everywhere. Everywhere. Mines everywhere. These mines were, are insane. I should have had these a long time ago. But uh, yeah, we had that forced, quote-unquote, try to reroll attempt that I get, went for. Did these even... Oh, they place on themselves, by the way. You can just hold everything down and they show it on themselves. I like this. We're not gonna do explosives yet. Nope. Nope. Stun, though. Ah, let's go with the shurikens. 
Is stun gonna protect us, by the way? I should take one stun to see if it actually freezes all opponents. Because, you know, I'm shooting everywhere anyway. So if stun is actually a freeze, like literally they don't move, then I should have at least one level in it. So that I can uh, freeze, the f freeze the whole screen pretty much. But I mean, if I find shurikens, I'm gonna take shurikens. Uh, yeah, we're gonna take the shurikens. We're very close to explosive shurikens. Very close. We need three more levels. And then we're gonna also try to get the electric shots, but I don't think we're gonna survive that much. We're already at the six minute mark, and I, I see like the screen is getting filled slowly. And I still don't know if I'm gonna get one shot or not. Although I have one brawler level up, so we should not get level up. We should not die because of the because of the fact we have that. Let's go with damage. Straight up. I could also go explosives right now. I'm shooting so many things at the same time. Might as well go explosions. Is the one train of thought. The other train of thought is if I go explosives this early, madness is gonna happen. I wanna take this. And let's take this. Luckily enough. Nah, it doesn't seem like stun is stunning them. They just get pushed back anyway. So as long as I do this, I should be safe. Yeah, I don't think so. I mean, I have a bunch of mines in the middle. Uh, by the way, this is me holding right click down. The mines are getting set up really often. Explosives. Shurikens first, I would say. Yeah, 4 out of 5 on the shurikens. I need one more level up on the shurikens and then I can take the explosives. Even though the run is most likely going to die at that point, at least we will have the explosive shurikens. are getting surrounded here. In our sanctuary of explosives, I'm trying to extend where my mines are on the ground. Roll this, roll this, roll this. Okay, really bad choices. I guess we're going to go with the crits. So now instead of 10% crit chance, we have 20. Which crit, crit chance is double damage as far as I understand. Up. Still setting up mines. I, these mines are insane, by the way. I think they might be better than the other item. I'm keeping the right click down and they're, they're really good. Okay, you're out for sure. You're also out for sure. And as well throw this. Also, of course, let's go brawler. Do not get one shot. And the time comes, I don't see my scythes, uh, my, my shurikens, and I'm a bit afraid that we're not gonna make it. Opponents start being a bit more survivable. Okay. It's going pretty decent. Ah, about to level up. I hope it's gonna be a scythe. <laughs> a shuriken. Oh, this increased damage. Ah! Nope. Uh oh. Uh oh. Most likely gonna pick this up. 10% crit chance or one more? Let's go with one more projectile. As that one more projectile has within it another six projectiles. Because of the spread. I was assuming we we're gonna get cooldown on the mines, not damage. I guess damage makes sense too. Although they do like what? Oh, they do only 20 damage. Yep. That's why they take 50% more damage as an upgrade. <laughs> Any damage is not gonna cut it at this point of this of the game. Oh man, we're not even gonna get the explosive regens. It's not like I'm not re-rolling. I'm really trying to get them, so. Let's see what we can get. See the mines are at the bottom. I'm afraid I'm gonna touch a mine and die. We're gonna take the explosives so I don't find the shurikens here. Let's take explosives and hope we survive. Did we get it? Is this it? What is happening? Are these explosives now or increase all projectile unlock by the 10% is the next upgrade we just unlocked? What is happening? What is happening? By the way, I have been told that there are settings to make sure that damage numbers... Let's uh, remove the damage numbers. So that particle effects? I think we want the particle effects. No, this is half the game. We definitely want the particle effects. Like everybody's going backwards. Uh, damage numbers. I remove damage numbers just so that maybe it's gonna... It's also maybe reduce a bit of bloom. Uh, there, there is a good hope that nothing is visible right now, although I have increased it. Wow, what was that guy? Although I have increased the bitrate, if nothing is visible again, I'm gonna increase the bitrate even further in the next run. I was not expecting this thing. <laughs> I was not expecting this madness here. 
Okay, so these are the explosions. So I still have not gotten the electric bullets or whatever it's called. No, the electric bullets is on if I go the stun route. No, no, no. Okay, piercing stun. Let's go with... Ah, might as well go with stun. I mean, piercing at this point doesn't even do anything. Can I get one more shuriken, please? We are madness here. Madness? This is... Dun, 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 dun. You know it. Let's continue going around. Pick up some XP. Yeah, explosions. I'm afraid of explosions. And then you pick them up and you literally are immortal because of it. Choices, man. Choices. So there are no more mine enemies. It's only these guys. I guess it's only these guys. And they're sliding, man. Sliding all around. I got a I got an achievement called Bomber Blitz. I guess because of the mines I have in the ground. Reroll, reroll. Impact. Increase on projectile knockback ten percent. Useless. Reroll. Wow, we didn't get anything that I would like to get. I guess we go with Brawler so we don't get one shot. Once again, continue going for the percentage based health. Although I think at this point, 5, five max health is going to be more health than 20% less damage taken. As I have 15 health and plus 5 health is 33% increase in health, while taking 20% less damage is 20% less damage. So it's a 22% increase in health, I think. I think that's how it goes. In general, having percentage based less damage taken uh, combos well with having a lot of max life. So if I had 10, it's better to have 20 life and 50% less damage taken than 10 life and 60% less damage taken. You know, let's see where we go. That might sound obvious, of course, but when the numbers are a bit more weird and different, you don't know what to, what is obvious and whatnot. Let's continue running around, picking up XP. Projectile size card, increase all projectile size by 50%. We got a new upgrade. I hope it's not gonna pop up right away. I hope we're gonna find the shuriken. <laughs> I'd like to get the synergy going. Nope. Nope. I might take this. Nope. I guess we're gonna take the piercing in case we get the other synergy going. Because there is a hope. There is hope we're gonna get the other synergy. And there isn't anything here that can one-shot us. Like, there aren't any more units that drop the mines on the ground. By the way, I'm not also getting meta... I I'm not getting meta progression currency from here either. That's bad. It's really bad that this area does not have meta progression currency. Wait a minute, can I attack this thing or not? On the one hand, it feels like I can. On the other hand, it feels like I can't. And I just lost a bunch of mines with, uh, with that endeavor. I think if I go over here to the left, it seems to be shooting on some... No, that was previously. Now that's not the case anymore. And we lost our whole minefield. Very nice. Let's set it up again. Slowly going in circles. Uh-oh. That was almost a one-shot. Ooh, that fling. We're gonna die from a random fling. And those flings get created by the explosives, by the way. The explosions are doing that. That's why I'm afraid of the explosions. The reason I'm trying to create a minefield here is because I want to, like, put it around me and then sit in the middle. Ooh, we've almost died there. Let's make it, like, smaller. We're at full life, so we should not be able to get one shot at this point. Uh, once again, I will try to go for max health if nothing else is there. Can I please find my last shuriken? Is that a possibility game? Oh, we lost a bunch of life again. I'm afraid we're gonna die. We don't even have that much regen or healing or anything, actually. That could protect us. Oof. 13 minutes. Man, we're, we're surviving. Really surviving. No projectile size. Are you kidding me right now? Regen. Piercing. The game is kidding me. Uh, piercing it is. I mean... I guess. Or HP regen. I have zero regen. Yeah, let's go with HP regen. Because I'm not gonna get one shot anyway. So might as well regen up while I have the time. 
Instead of, instead of you know, dying within... So I will die in two hits. And uh, if, if they come like back to back, like if a million opponents come close to us and we die, then so be it. But if only one person is gonna hit us, then it's as if I have a cooldown of my life insurance, right? So if, if I die, for example, if, if I get hit twice within 10 seconds, then I die because of the lifesteal I have. Now with the HP regen I have, I guess if I get hit twice within 5 seconds, I die. That was the idea behind that. So that I can heal back up very quickly if I get hit randomly. Man, we're not getting any XP. This map is really bad. I don't like this map at all anymore. Like, the, the infinity part is pretty boring. The I don't get any meta progression whatsoever. I would have preferred to be on the second map again, or even the first one for that matter. Like, this map doesn't provide anything. The first map provides a bunch of enemies, so a bunch of XP, and also a bunch of meta progression currency. The second map provides only a bunch of opponents and a bit of meta progression currency, but you get so many opponents that you can pick up so much XP to level up and try things. But this map, eh, eh, it's the easiest yet, uh, as opponent, as what opponents is concerned. But it's also a bit boring. I don't know what they should add here. Maybe more XP. Like it feels like the opponents are mid-sized. That's the main problem. I'm gonna stick in the middle of my minefield for a moment here to regen. Nobody come close to us. Yeah, do you remember when I said 10 seconds to survive and then I reduced it to 5? Yeah, it's more like 20 seconds to survive and I reduced it to 15. <laughs> That's going pretty decent. Okay, we're back to full, so let's go out and continue building up the minefield. Look at these little crosses being all over each other. And the fact that there are patterns here shows to me that they seem to be getting placed on a grid. Do you see that there are patterns here? Like... They, they, they don't like this pattern over here like they don't seem random receive five of each part crystal that was a bad mental regression upgrade if if not useless can i get my one shuriken that's the only thing i ask for one shuriken man one shuriken come on i even pick up the explosive for this thing come on come on there should be some kind of system that the sh that realizes if you have synergies and tries to give them to you I don't know. I mean, the closer you are to synergies, the higher the chance that you get the synergistic item. Something like that. Sift crying about making the game even easier. Of course. I want to have broken builds. I mean, do you see us losing here? We're going to lose anyway. Might as well give me the free uber item just to test it out. Come on, give me, give me shuriken. Give me shuriken. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. Oh, man. It's never going to give me the shuriken. We're going to go piercing. Is it actually true that I'm missing just one shuriken? No, I have them. Wait, break red crystal. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. There is another mechanic on top of it. Yeah, it doesn't matter what I do here. I'm not going to get any upgrade. I, I, I don't, I mean, if, okay, I'm about to say that this should not be a mechanic, but no, I'm going to say something different. If, if you have the system in the game, then you should make sure that every single game drops crystals, you know? Uh, I would like to hear some opinions on this, by the way, on the comments. I, I, I'm 99% sure, like, not 99%, sure, I, I don't back out of this. If you have a system that says you have to pick up a currency to be able to level up the weapons, then you should make sure uh, that every single stage drops this currency. Because I, I'm, I'm waiting here for this whole hour and, like, I, I, I will just say that the dev is somewhere in the background being like, No Sift! You cannot level up the shuriken because of this and this. And he's like, oh no, oh no, no, he's gonna talk about it. Oh no, 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 no. If he, if he realizes that he cannot get the synergy, man, he's gonna talk about it. <laughs> oh, we're about to get one shot, by the way. Did you just see that I, I start losing more life than I normally was? Um, You know what? Honestly speaking, I, I'm thinking about just ending this run right now. Uh, because... Uh, the synergy is just not gonna happen and I don't see like anything reasonable here. XP healing? What is that? Maybe I want to unlock the XP healing. Okay, may maybe I'm gonna stick to unlock the XP healing. Imagine if... I guess it's like every time you pick up XP you heal. That would be the best form of healing in this game if that exists. I'm still pretty alive. I'm really disappointed. The thing is I can't even get any other synergy. By the way, what is more important? <laughs> nah, we're gonna stick here and if we die, we die. I'm, I'm not gonna yeet myself into the destruction just because it's like the, that's the crybaby out. 
Oh, the game is didn't give me what I wanted to. I'm gonna just just, just lose. Obviously, if if it's speed run or if if there is a purpose to this, we died. We died, and 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 I'm really happy about something specific. We died exactly the way I predicted we would die. A random flinging opponent's gonna hit us, and that that is what happened. If you want to go back and see the footage, an opponent just flung onto us. We're gonna destroy that. Accept my faith. Uh, I want to test something here really, really, really quick. Are you allowed to touch the, um, the... the What is this called? Oh, you're not allowed to touch the walls. That's why I wanted to try. Nice. Instantly known. So, we got a new ship. We're never, ever, 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 ever gonna go to this level ever again. Because it does not provide us with the meta progression currency, which then means that it also does not provide us with uh, the legendary upgrades. Uh, I want to see just the stats of the tank. So... So this thing is a tank, Kronko. An absolute tank can withstand a lot of firepower as well as dish out huge high damage bullets. So instead of 15 health, it does 50. It has also half regen. It goes extremely slow, 20. No, it's the normal speed of the duster, nice. It has a dash that I'm pretty much never using. Okay, so right now it's just a straight up better than the duster. It does 10 damage per second. It attacks once every half second. Still more DPS than the duster. And no piercing building, and also the bullets literally die in front of you. Yeah, so this 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 ship is like, it also explodes. The ship isn't. Oh no, it doesn't explode. It's just an animation. It's just an animation. Okay, we're gonna we're not gonna do this run. We're gonna end this here. Uh, look at this. We got nothing from the stage. What a bad stage, man. What a bad stage. Plus fifteen. Yeah, let's put it on attack speed. And uh, yeah, I think that's going to be it for today. So, as I said, I'm going to be doing a run of this every single day. Maybe I should reduce it to one run instead of two runs, just so that it's a 3D minute video instead of a 50 minute video. I'm going to see. I'm going to think about this next run. And uh, yeah, I'm also going to try to next time get at least the synergies going, you know, because obviously today was a bit of a fail day, but it is what it is. I'm not even sure if anybody else covers this, but anyway, let's let's just do the outro here and end this. I, I, I still believe what I said, but I don't think I need to do a whole analysis. If I'm going to be playing this daily, I don't need to do an analysis outro every time. So, first of all, thanks for all the Patreon supporters. It's really helping. And if you also want to help me, you know, drop a like, helps out the channel if you don't want to become a Patreon, you know. And uh, I would like to hear some opinions on this, the things I discussed within the run. And uh, by the way, I'm slowly starting to, you know, because this game is pretty brain dead, I will slowly transition over to, instead of talking about the game, I will be talking about, you know, different things in my life or ideas or thought processes or whatever. But right now, we're still looking at the builds, still looking at the items, looking at the synergies. So for now, maybe the me, me talking about this might be boring for some, might be actually not boring for some. But uh, I just want to point out right away that um, in, no matter if you're with the, I like the explanatory, uh, what is it, analysis, or I don't like the explanatory analysis, uh, I just want to tell you that in about maybe, I don't know, a few days, I will start uh, transitioning over to just discussion about random stuff. But for now, we're just going to be talking about the game. Anyway, uh, I think that's going to be it for today. What is XP healing? I can read this even beforehand. Increase all project. No, that's not it. <laughs> synergy between XP gain and regen. Ah, it's another synergy. I like it. I like it. Ah, atomic daggers card. First daggers and directions your ship is moving. Hmm, synergy between impact projectile size. I've never taken any of these. Receive 5 each part crystal. I think these like are extremely bad ones and boring ones. 5 on each part crystal. I laugh. Ranged ship. Blaster ship. Multi-missile synergy. Synergy between torpedoes and split shots. Toxic wasteland full of cocoons. Yeah, we're gonna see these. We're gonna see these. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed. I definitely did. Anyway, thanks for watching. And see you guys around.